For years, the poor of Medina would find food left on their doorsteps. They only found out who the mystery donor was the day he passed away. He was the great grandson of the Prophet ﷺ, Zainul Abidin Ali ibn al Hussein radiallahu anhuma. When they bathed him, they saw marks on his back and shoulders due to him carrying the food to the homes of the poor. Fasting teaches us ikhlas, sincerity. Ikhlas refers to doing everything solely for the sake of Allah Azza wa Jal. Our beloved Prophet ﷺ said, Every action of the son of Adam is multiplied, a good deed receiving a tenfold to seven hundredfold rewards. Allah Azza wa Jal says, Except for fasting, it is for me and I will personally reward it. He abandons his desires and food for my sake. Fasting is not something you actively do, but it is what you do not do, i.e. not eating, drinking and intimacy. No one else can ever be 100% certain if you are fasting or if you may have broken your fast in secret. This is something only Allah Azza wa Jal fully knows. As fasting helps us to develop ikhlas, this should trickle down to other parts of our lives. In these few days left for Ramadan, cultivate your ikhlas by having a special secret deed between you and Allah, just like the great grandson of our beloved Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam.